to tell me what's been bothering you. No, I don't like being outdoors. Tell me you've left the house in three days. Mm. One, two, three. Have you eaten anything in three days? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Besides canned tuna? Mm -hmm. Anything else? Obviously, I have a lot of ticks. <laughs> These distractions affected your work of late? What would you do if you had to change careers? What, if I wasn't an antiques broker? If you weren't a criminal. <laughs> this is Dr. Klein. I just got off the phone with Angela, your daughter. She so says she really wants to meet you. Remember me? All of a sudden, I have a daughter. Get in here! Now you have to set an example for someone else. Bear. Uh... Cheers. Uh... Just try to be as honest and open with them as possible. Right. You're a con man? A con artist. And that guy, Frank? He's my partner. Teach me something. Rule number one, never work near where you live. Don't. Rule number two, yeah. don't write anything down. <laughs> you regret it, exposing her to that? Well, uh, you know, it was a little... It, it made me feel a little... I, you know, I was a little... I really liked it. How much do you think we can take that guy for? 30 grand. More. This 14-year-old girl working these people with me. My dad's a smooth operator. <laughs> I'm not very good at being a dad. I barely get by being me. You good to go? Is a poo in the woods? Just say yes, okay? There's one last thing. What? I want you to give the money back. This is so... You think crime doesn't pay? No, it does. Does just not very well. We're a 24 hour news network looking for a 24 hour story, and one just fell from the sky. They can throw us out of here anytime they want. We're gonna have to be crafty. We can be crafty. CNN, American Television. How will you be paying? Uh, American Express. I'm kidding. I want to interview with President Saddam Hussein. You take liberties from America, but liberty people. There's a history in this region about which you people don't know. They call the President Bosch instead of Bush. He's a Bosch in Arabic means nothing. You stop shooting, they all go home. The final seconds of the countdown to possible war ticked off in Iraq. That deadline has now expired. ABC and CBS are pulling out. We could be the only ones able to report. If there is a war, we're there reporting live behind enemy lines as a journalistic equivalent of walking on the moon. No story is worth risking your life. What would you do, Ed? This is a story of a lifetime. Stay in Baghdad, you may find yourself dead. He was a spy and we hang him! He was a journalist and you murdered him. You know what just happened? We just became the story. <laughs> I got a government pill! Come on, Miss I'm asking you to go. Hello, Atlanta. There is something happening outside. This is it! The skies of Baghdad are illuminated. Huge flashes of light. The bombs are falling. We are going live to Baghdad.